should be a good day. Will be a good day. Of course it will. I'm going fishing. So we've got two days to catch ourselves, hopefully, Cole Valley carp or two. Getting excited. Right, we are first in the gate, but there are a lot of people turning up now that are going to want to go, I'm guessing, where we're going to want to go. So it's going to be more like run, run, run. Now this is day ticket fishing and day session fishing, so you've got to be on your toes. Stop it. Stop me and buy two. Wanting to clear these branches before I stop panicking. Good fish, mate. Almost, almost, almost. <laughs> now, it's often said, and I'm going to say it, don't you just love it when a plan comes together? It's going to be a lovely day today. She's creeping over the horizon there, and for once, we've got a fresh, friendly wind and a bit of sunshine rather than rain. Should be a good day. Will be a good day. Of course it will. We'll go and fish it. Day sessions. Got used to them lately. I haven't fished the venue we're going to probably for a couple of years now, but it does suit what we want. Big venue, I'll tell you which one it is in a minute. Lots of snaggy corners, which is ideal for this time of year. And I did walk the venue yesterday and there wasn't many anglers on. And there's been a few fish out, but it's quite a, uh, a famous old lake in the Colne Valley. But back to day sessions, I've done a lot this winter and got used to it. Light a barrow, leaving home just before light, getting home just after dark. And do you know what? It's harder work than chucking a bed chair out and spawning the life out of a swim. Uh, for 24, 48 hours. So today we're off to Thorny Weir in the Cold Valley. And I've got two day sessions. So I will be going home this evening. There's no one allowed to night fish it, which I'm quite comfortable with, because if I'm not, which I don't want to do anyway, because of the, the, uh, the current rules, at least no one else is either, which sounds a bit selfish, but it's the way it is. So we've got two days to catch ourselves, hopefully, Cold Valley carp or two. That's not a bad sign, is it? 10 minutes before the gate opens and we're the only one here. That's what we like to do. That's why we left home early. We're in a built up area. I've got skip lorries, I've got cranes. My God, anyone who knows Thorny Weir will know. Well, we're about to enter it anyway. Dave will be here. Five minutes and we're the only ones here. Brilliant. So as I said earlier, there was only two on yesterday. With what's going on in the world, I don't think the lakes have been that busy. Good chance today. Getting excited, getting excited. By six o'clock this evening, we we'll began. Should have had one, you know. <laughs> should, should have had one. I do feel we should have had one. Right, we are first in the gate, but there are a lot of people turning up now that are going to want to go. I'm guessing where we're going to want to go. So it's going to be more like run, run, run. I, I honestly think I should just get down there with a bucket and then come back for the barra. I'm just going to grab a bucket and walk around with you, Rich. Then we'll come back for the stuff, mate. Yeah, these lads were here yesterday baiting up. Right, Rich. We're going to walk around first. And it is a long way, but we're going to walk around, put that in a swim and then come back for the barra. I think that's the best way. That's the corner over there, you mean, isn't it? <sighs> Rushing about, in the, Neil the bailiff was kind enough to whiz round here with me. Now, there's only two other lads here, and they've just gone past me anyway, so it was worth running around here with a bucket. Now, this is day ticket fishing and day session fishing, so you've got to be on your toes. This is where I wanted to start, 
there's another, we've got two more options uh, that the lads haven't gone in. They've gone in two of the swims that I've, I've baited yesterday, but day session and day tickets. Out here, you can see where people normally fish, where the spawn's hanging off the tree. So um, I did put a bit of bait off the snags yesterday. A few little boilies, a few maggots, a few pellets. So, bucket down, high tail it back to the van, barrel on, let's get round here, let's get some fishing done.